mosquito had a brilliant idea. Booyah! The book is an alphabet book. So the first character is Austin the Babuguana, and then there's Charles the Duckophant. So it goes through the alphabets. It's like it's two animals and we just mash them up, um, like a cardinal and a hare, like a hairdinal. And there's a baboon and an iguana, which is a babuguana. And then there's a jaguar and a moose, which is a jaguar moose. And so we just had so much fun with it. Neither of us uh, does book illustrations or writing at all. My sister thinks I'm nuts, and um, although I think she's crazy too. She does incredible whimsical art with uh, all kinds of interesting creatures and bugs and all that kind of stuff. And we just thought we would do a book together and it would just was going to be an alphabet book, just very, very simple. And it kind of grew from there. So my dad is a storyteller and my mom is a visual artist, so the combination came easily to us, so we just allowed it to, to grow. Mosquito's tummy went rumble, rumble, burble, burble, growl, growl, growl. The entire thing was done remotely. Monica is in St. Pascal Bailon, which is just outside of Ottawa in Ontario, and um, I was here and we did the entire thing um, you know, using Zoom or Messenger or whatever, and it worked just great. Seriously Canadian. Yeah, it was printed in Canada. We were very proud of that. And for me, it had something also to do in a tiny little bit about diversity and inclusion and how it doesn't matter what you look like or what you're, what you're, you know, what, what it, 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 that stuff doesn't matter. It's, it's just who you are and acceptance. Monica and I are both uh, seriously fond of food in general. <laughs> so the element of food was important to us. Um, we, uh, the, the, we had so much fun figuring out what these creatures were gonna eat and what the what mosquito was going to snatch from the jumbo mold. So the food part was interesting to us too. There's a lot of repetition and rhythm in the book. There's a, there's a beat to the book. We think it's for anybody. Like I think it's just, it's that kind of book. And, and we, we, the book does not talk down to kids. So if the expectation that we were using simple words, we did not. 